Gary McKenzie. In 2009, you were diagnosed with Rett syndrome, a severe form of autism for females. The diagnosis stated you wouldn't be able to walk, talk, you wouldn't be able to have personal hand movement, or you wouldn't be able to feed through a tube. Not only have you not let this define you, but you have used this as a gateway to advocate for others. Through that advocacy, you have helped change policies within the state legislation, as well as Metro Nashville Public Schools. While in high school, you were able to help invent new and inclusive ways of being a class president, a varsity cheerleader, as well as becoming the first ever nonverbal ambassador for Metro Nashville Public Schools. That is so proud of you. You continue to amaze us. We are truly excited to go with you and watch you fulfill your life mission to educate others and give the other individuals a voice with disabilities. Lead on, Mackenzie. We love you, Mom and Dad. Oh, Mackenzie is just such a light. Her vibe, her energy just radiates effortlessly off Mackenzie. Um, she always greets you with a smile and a hug. Anybody who's around, and no matter what ability you have, no matter what barriers may be in your way, no matter what obstacles are in your way, she has helped show other teachers just how there's other ways to show that you're successful, that you're learning and that you're doing all these things and enjoying your, getting your full high school experience, but it doesn't always have to be the cookie cutter way. Mackenzie is a great representation of a white school high school cheerleader. She shows great spirit at every game. We want other students to see that just because you have a disability doesn't mean you can't do all the things. And she does all the things. My mission in life is to educate and give a voice to all individuals with disabilities. I do not want any individual to be afraid to be the first. I am thankful to be able to represent individuals with special needs. Tighten up.